so what's up guys uh welcome back this is your boy gadam slink how you guys doing welcome to another crazy video and uh good morning good afternoon good evening depending on where you guys are watching this video from in as much i do not wish anyone bad you know and i consider blessing ceo as uh, my colleague but the only difference is that i do not categorically state that any information is coming directly from me i do not categorically state that i only make reaction videos well of course you know that she was arrested recently and uh she uh she spent uh, more than or she's still in jail she was arrested on friday and uh saturday sunday monday and now on tuesday she was granted bail to the tune of 10 million naira okay we know blessed ceo got money right but come on man nobody will want to spend 10 million naira on bail now you know how many bottles of water blessed ceo should have used that money to buy instead of putting his mouth in someone's business he could as easily just uh but uh simply just bought one bottle of water 100 naira and just use it to chill and uh, leave ivd and bean bob case alone but obviously she decided to put her mouth and uh, she said she was ivd therapist of course guys let's be honest the entrances whatever she was saying then uh, was really really awful you know saying that she knew that i uh, iv this wife bimbo wanted to die that she always wanted to buy all those kind of things now come on really crazy and this is somebody you have never seen before you do not know you are not part of them why they were struggling going through the heartbreaks and the divorce and uh, them settling back so many things that these guys were doing you weren't there and now all of a sudden apparently she started dating ivd <laughs> oh man well she has been granted 10 million naira bail and uh 10 million naira guys that is extremely painful i'm very much sure 10 million naira is even way more than what she used to do her bootos recently 10 million naira just go just like that over someone's case over someone's case 10 million naira guys well i feel pity for her but at the same time i think uh, she got what she was asking for and according to to, to dk while reacting to this she said i hate to see people suffer even though they bring it upon themselves but this lady need to be dealt with i watched her berate a dead woman i watched her bring pain and sorrow to the dead i mean anyone can support the husband as a support system which many did privately but to publicly insult blame and intrude on such a delicate and sensitive issue she needs to feel their pain too i feel no pity for her and yash will be okay after all i do nyash too and he no like he no leak no get problem she did the deed wrong and dies on period justice for bim bomb <laughs> well that's coming from to, to dk and honestly i kind of like uh understand where to the dk is coming from bim bomb uh blessed ceo took her mouth too much too deep into the affair she should have taken a chill pill and uh, take it with 100 naira bottle water i believe she, she would have avoided the whole scenario yeah huh? i believe she should have avoided the old scenario instead of paying 10 million naira now somebody should have used te like you know just relax forget the old matter but uh, you decide to put your mouth on someone's issue well she kind of like deserve it though so moving past that let's talk about uh donald trump 
So now Trump has been arrested, guys. Can you imagine? The first ex president in the United States of America history to be arrested. And according to uh, the nation Nigeria, they said former U.S. president arrested the former U.S. President Donald Trump has been formally arrested after his arrival at a New York courthouse where he will become the first former U.S. President to face criminal charges. And according to another media, they said the 76 years old, who is the first former U.S. President to be arrested on criminal charge, is being arranged at the Manhattan Criminal Courthouse over an alleged 130,000 US dollar hush money payment given to adult film actress Stormy Daniel on his behalf in the run up to the 2016 presidential election, which he, won, which he won. Sky News report that the said sum was allegedly made to prevent her from discussing a sexual encounter she said she had with Trump at a hotel in Lake in 26, 2006. The Trump uh, former personal lawyer, Michael, has said the ex-president directed him to arrange the 130000 US dollar payment to Ms. Daniel and Trump has acknowledged reimbursing him for the payment, with the Trump organization lodging the reimbursement as legal expenses. Trump has denied any wrongdoing and in due to plead not guilty. Well, the whole idea is that the whole thing is that Trump, being a U while he was running for president in the twenty in a few years ago, you know. While in 2006, he paid, there is this sexual uh, encounter he had with a porn star. So while he was running for the, pre for the president, this woman wanted to discuss that matter. So Trump said, you know what, you cannot discuss it, I'm going to settle you. So Trump gave that woman 130,000 US dollars. That 130,000 US dollars is not a problem. I don't know what's the offense there. Let me say I I um I want to become a president. Hmm? Then someone that I had intercourse with said, "Oh, I'm going to say I'm going to do an interview about you and I encounter it, and I have proof like pictures that I want to sell online." Then I say, "You know what? Okay, don't sell don't sell it. I'm going to give you so so, so money." <laughs> So now the issue, I, I don't know. I don't know how is that a problem. Based on my personal opinion, I think that's his private life. Huh? Maybe I'm looking at it with our Nigeria mentality. You know, over here we have politicians who have done way worse than that. You know, they can carry any girls they want. We would generally say it's their business. They can do anything. We have had... Uh, uh, a, a, a presidential can candidate who said, run away with it, snatch it. No, all those kind of uh, statement. And yet, they still run for office. Well, Trump just only uh, paid a woman not to talk about their past history. In fact, the court will arrest that woman. For blackmailing Trump. <laughs> but now Trump is being arrest is arrested, is getting arrested for settling that woman. And not even directly from him. A lawyer did the settlement and he paid his lawyer through legal fees. So what is the whole issue here? <laughs> man, things are really, really going crazy, man. <laughs> well, it is what it is, and uh, I wish him all the best. So, so, apart from that, guy, let's talk about files. You know, files is being uh, targeted, not in a way targeted, but APC and uh, INEC. Let me say INEC are not really, really happy about the way FAS is portraying their 
their chairman, Mr. Yakubu. You know, first day that Mr. Yakubu song, and uh, the f song actually trended. So let's uh, listen to first reasons why he decided to do that song. Music, music is a medium of expression. It's an expression of rage. It's an expression of frustration. It's an expression of anger. It's, it's fury. It's, this is the way that we're feeling. And I'm, there's absolutely nothing I'm saying on this record, or Vector is saying on this record, that hasn't occurred. It's not, we're not bringing, we're not, we're not fabricating facts. We're not making things up. We're not painting a scenario that did not occur. We're telling, I'm telling you things as they happened. You know, we, we went out there, we voted, and suddenly everything was scattered before our very eyes. And absolutely nothing was done about that. And even upon all the numerous, numerous cases of violence that we witnessed, upon all the very shoddy and shabby looking uh, 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 manipulated results that we saw with our very eyes, the INEC chairman still went on to declare a winner. And as for the presidential election, <laughs> uh, uh, as, as the presidential election is concerned, in the dead of the night, you know. So, I mean, it, it, it was all just um, a big mess. It was all a big mess.